This handsome plant is burdock. Burdock, Arctium lapa or Arctium major. The only difference is the size of the leaves. Um, this is a first year burdock, which we can tell because it grows in a rosette and doesn't have a flower stalk coming up the center, which it does in its second year. It's a biennial plant. I value this plant so much. I say burdock is the plant that helps us go from being a warrior to being a warrior, a peaceful warrior. Um, and how this plant does that, or at least in part, is it has this deep, deep tap root that goes boom down into the ground. And when we take this plant into our cells, it helps us put our tap root down into the ground very well too. This is a plant that we can use for everyday tonifying of the kidneys, the lymph, the liver. We can drink infusion, which is actually quite sweet and tasty, or we can use a tincture of the plant. Um, it also happens to be one of my favorite plants to use for potent ivy rash, otherwise known as poison ivy, but I try to befriend it so I call it potent instead. The skin responds well to when we take a whole leaf of the burdock, which means burr, it gets these burrs on the flower stalk and dock means big leaf, so it's the big leaf plant with burrs. We take a whole leaf of the burdock cover it with a little bit of boiling water and let it sit for five to ten minutes and then take that out and put that softened leaf over the rash and it almost feels like you've opened a freezer door. It cools it right down. Burdock is helpful for helping to clear the skin and but it's not a plant that just works on the surface. It goes deep down into the body systems to bring up and out whatever is um, not being moved through uh, the system well, right, through the lymph system or the liver or the kidneys. And so a little word of warning is sometimes burdock will make skin worse before it gets better. But it also is an herb I turn to in any serious illness, any blood disease, any kind of cancer, burdock will have a place in the repertoire. So it's everything from every day to the most extreme of situations and I love to show you, I show all people this one simple exercise for calming and centering. Um, you, I'm going to take these two fingers of each hand and I'm going to put them right into the center of the rosette. And I guarantee you that if you are feeling frazzled and you do this for silently and just breathe for, yeah, let's say 20 to 30 seconds. I've done this with teenage boys, I've done it with elders, I've done it with all kinds of people. Every single one of them has said, wow, that really shifted my whole, like my whole state of my being. So this is something you can go outside and do. And it's, it shows us that sometimes we don't even have to take the plants for them to help us to heal ourselves. Burdock.